Welcome to another... My name is Barry Allen, and I am the fastest man alive. Oh, I hate When you. I was a child, my I mother was murdered so by something much. impossible. But then an accident made me the impossible. To the outside world, I'm an ordinary forensic scientist. Oh, the worst. But right. secretly, but secretly, with the help of my friends at Star Labs, I fight crime and find other metahumans like me. But I became lost in time. <laughs> okay, 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 we're shutting that shit down. This is our top five flash. <coughs> Goddamn. Still sick. But yeah, um, this is our top five flashes. I'm Ollie. And I'm Cisco, and let's just hop into it. My number five is Will Friedel. Even though, even though I know he didn't play the Flash specifically. A Flash. Played A Flash. Played A Flash, but he's still he's still in there because there's not a lot of notable flashes. <laughs> there's not a lot of notable ones. Talking about two times go. Yes, we are. Wolf Friedle, Wally West, Teen Titans Go. Oh. Oh. And Teen Titans. I enjoy Wolf Friedle because... He was... He was, he was, he was, he was he? No. He? No, I thought it was Teen Titans as well. No. Michael Rosenbaum. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I enjoy Wolf Friedle because it's Wolf Friedle. He is a very hyperactive... I also like how in Teen Titans Go... He is, he is just constantly on Robin's shit. He's like, you shitty Robin. What do you even do? You have no powers. But That's yeah. That's I am with Batman. Yeah. My, but yeah, aside from that, I like Wolf Friedle. You? My five. number five is John Wesley Ship. Oh, so he's at the bottom. Okay. what's What do you like about John Wesley Ship? Uh, John. Although, if we're talking about his Barry Allen... That's a part of the 90s where we didn't take the source material seriously. It was interesting, but his Jay Garrick. Perfect. Peak fiction. Peak. That from now, that's like, that's like, you know, we'll talk about it. We'll talk about that later. Okay. Um, number four. Another, another, another Wally West. Um, Charlie Slater. Oh. Yeah. From the, from the DCAU. Yeah. The first Flash. First Flash to ever appear on an animation. No, wait, no. The, in, in the DCAU. Yeah, the DCAU. Yeah, I like Charlie Slater mostly because he just fits the vibe of the of the DCAU. Mostly because like the the way the way that he, the way that he was doing his voice acting was a lot was really it fit Wally's character. But that's one episode. Oh, he only he's only there for one episode. Yeah. What was it after him? Michael Rosenbaum. Of course, it was fucking Michael Rosenbaum. Why, why wouldn't it be Michael fucking Rosenbaum? I mean, Charlie did come back to voice him in others. The Batman. The Batman. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like Charlie Slater, man. He, he was a good dude. Or for you? My number four is James Arnold Taylor as oh. Lego Flash. And yeah. he's also Flash in Young Justice for the like there was a guy before him but he ended up replacing that guy with better voice yeah he, i would i would say he, he's he's he okay. barry a personality yeah he does barry's a lot of really hyperactive and shit in, in the lego verse like the cool uncle yeah I, I like that i like that number three okay <laughs> these are just my list of wally west <laughs> Good. jason spizak Fuck, what, what? Oh, Young Justice. Yeah, Young Justice. Son of a bitch! Yeah. Jason Spizak. I like I like him mostly because that's that's the definitive voice of Wally West, in my opinion. That's him mostly because I mostly because he get he get he gave me like a real sense of Wally's character. So I really uh, I really enjoy him more than anything <laughs> else. Best quips too. He had the best quips for Wally. And they they keep trying to bring Wally back, and I and niggas are sad that Wally's dead, but we need to we need to leave him. We need to hey, leave him buried. Hey, hey, yeah, hey, leave him buried. Call me a tits, Billy. <laughs> if we can have your dumbass Flash come back from the grave, 
I don't like I don't like Barry Allen. I wish it was Wally West, but in the context of that show, Wally's dead. There's probably a speed <coughs> force. We just haven't gotten to it yet. If they find a way to bring him back, then fine. But that's gonna be a lot of emotional turmoil. That's Good. gonna be lo- that's gonna make his death pointless. Is what no. I'm saying. Just like when Barry sacrificed himself in Crisis, now that Crisis, now that sacrifice means nothing because he's back. You know who you can blame for that? Jeff, Jeff Johns. Johns. Jeff Johns. Uh, you're killing my favorite for your stupid, outdated Wonder Bread Flash. No one likes Barry Allen, but we'll get to Barry Allen later because you're okay. You're saying number three. Oh, my number three is another Wally, Josh Keaton from Isis on Two Earths. Oh, yeah. You know that animated movie where they, they fight the yeah. crime syndicate. My favorite quote is that uh, it's that scene where Batman telep- he's eating a uh, pretzel he's like <laughs> in France and uh, he teleports him and he's like what? You can't just teleport me? And then Batman eats his pretzel and then <laughs> was another part where he, he was really good. If you're getting my favorite Spider-Man yeah. to be my favorite Flash, that's, that's good. Yeah. The quips were solid. A1. Like, I didn't think Josh Keaton would be a good Wally West, but good. Okay, now for my number two. My number two is Grant Gustin. Son of a <laughs> bitch. I love Grant Gustin as Mary Allen. I'm, Why? Because he did something that no one has, else has been able to do. What? They gave Grant Gu- they gave Barry Allen a personality. Oh, his personality is crying like a little bitch is singing. That's something. That's so- that's so- at the very least that is something. That what is the something. Redhead ass, and I'm gonna give all of Wally's storylines to Barry because Barry don't have any cool shit. Exactly. Dying. Exactly, but like, Wonder Bread. I enjoy Barry Barry in that show simply because of because it's the same reason why I like Tom Holland because of his constant confusion, because of his constant confusion and contempt for everything. Because the first three seasons is Barry being like shitty, shitty superhero. I need to get I need to get faster. I need to get faster, Iris. Please, I want to be with you. Please. <laughs> Don't, Iris. You, don't you say the fucking line. <laughs> don't you say it. I'll sing it right now. Oh, I can't. I can't sing it. I'm sick. <laughs> yeah, good. You're lucky. I would I would have I would have made a I would have busted out a cover of I'm of I'm running home to you right oh, now. Oh, son of a bitch. I would have busted out a cover of I'm running home to you, Billy. Love that song. Ugh, whatever. I number two. Neil Patrick Harris. Oh. Uh New Frontier. Oh. Uh, it's Barry Allen, but very pleasant, Ray Allen. Yes, it is. He's very, he's, he did a very serviceable job. He's probably one of the most memorable characters besides Wonder Woman. Uh, Diana, did you kill all these men? No, I just let the woman out of the cages. Just gave him the sticks and just and just sat back and just sat back and did and just watched what happened. Uh, just let the pieces unfold. Oh, God. yeah. That's all I can say. I can't really say that much. Spider-Man voicing a Flash. Okay, my number one. Oh, I don't have any honorable mentions. There's not that many Flashes that I... I got some. What are your honorable mentions? All right. First, it's Jason Marsden. Oh. Impulse. Oh, I forgot about him. Yes, he he very, very much loved Bart Allen. So, yeah. yeah. See Bart Allen, CW, Santa Maria. We could okay no we could fucking li- we could end up liking him Jordan Fisher we could end up liking Jordan Fisher we haven't seen him yet as of the time of this recording second mention is Jason Spizak oh from Justice okay man it's Wally West yeah it's Wally West but yeah okay my number one my number one and we're going back to it's your number five John Wesley Ship go on okay. The only Flash to ever be correctly represented in media outside of comics is Jay Garrick. You know why? 
that it's John Wesley's ship because they they got him they got him right like that. They understood. That is the only Flash character who I ever who I think was represented perfectly because they fucked up Wally. They gave Barry Wally's Wally's personality. We haven't seen Bart yet. No one gives a fuck about Nora. And no one cared enough about Jesse to care. They got Jesse okay. Yeah. Jesse okay. The origin's not right. Do you care about Jesse Quick's origin? No. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, they got they basically Jay Garrick, perfect the perfect, perfect fucking thing. Cause they got his personality right. They got his importance to the the guy's importance to the Flash mythos right. The twist was right. Like like we like remember in season two when they, when he came up and said, Yeah, hi, my name is Jay Garrick. I'm Flash from another world. I was like, what? <laughs> I was like, whoa! Yeah, that's, that's pretty. I was, I've been waiting. I was sitting there like, where's, where's Jay? You're not Jay. Jay's supposed to be old. And then at the end of the season, I am the real Jay Garrett. <laughs> and then, like, he comes back and later in the show, and it's like, Barry, come on. Come on <laughs> what are you man. doing, man? I'm on, I'm on my earth trying to fight Mark Hamill, man. What's going on, man? What are you doing? And, and then, I don't know what I love. I love how he gives Barry the speech about the little cup. And then he and then Barry goes on to give that same speech to Nora. Very nice and wholesome. I, I enjoy John Wesley Ship. Not as Barry Allen, but as Jay Garrick. John Wesley Ship. Another firm handshake. <laughs> uh, that's my number one. My number one is not gonna be a surprise to anyone who knows me. It's gonna be Michael Rosenbaum. <laughs> DCAU Flash. Wally West. When I think of Wally West, the voice I hear is not Michael Rosenbaum. It's Jason Spizak. Yeah. But Michael Rosenbaum is a really, really good second choice. Yeah. He was funny. He had the quips. Hey, Big Bertha. It's Barda. <laughs> it's that <laughs> not what I said. <laughs> uh, I had a dinner with two women at the same time. On. I had dinner with two women at the same time. Because I'm a stud. Cause I'm a stud. <laughs> yeah, he just he, he nailed it. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah, and that was our little video on the top five flashes on the top ten flashes. And our our, our best. If flashes. you have other ones that you'd like to talk about, go down to the comments. Or if you're mad that we disrespected any of your flashes, comment down in the comments. Grant Gustin is no. If you're I, mad that Grant Gustin hate, is number two, but I hate I hate. Listen, I have nothing against Grant Gustin himself. It's the writing of the show that I don't like. Because Grant Gustin, as bad as Ezra. We're not talking about Ezra. <laughs> We're not talking about Ezra Miller. <laughs> We're not gonna talk about Ezra Miller right now. I don't want to get mad. If you if you want to talk about Ezra Miller, go back in the comments. Go in the comments. But yeah, um, we'll see you guys next time. <laughs>